No, you're fine. I was just like, I just saw it like at a glance and I was like, I don't know. I don't know what. <laughs> I didn't know how to read. So I was getting my other ducks in a row. I was getting my life together. But hi, thank you for nine months. Has it been nine months? Time has been a flying. A flying. Uh, hi, I hope you're doing okay, buddy. Um, gosh, I'm like all broken out. I literally like I'm gonna be putting on a gazillion pimple patches tonight. Cause I just um I'm breaking out. Uh, it's fine. We're fine. Hi, Pixie. How are you doing? I'm alive. You're alive. We're all here and alive. I had a doctor's appointment today. And that was the only productive thing that I can say I did today. I mean, I guess I did a little bit of grocery shopping. And I played some League of Legends. But that's not, like... That's not... Oh, thank you, Tanny. I just am... Kriya's parents are back in town for the night. Back in town? Why? That feels like a random time. What happened? I'm looking at my calendar. I just feel like, oh, a few weeks. You know what? Never mind. I am acting surprised. I realize that I've been told all of this information before. I just didn't think it was happening right now. I know all of the things. I have all of the tea. I know what. I know why they're going to the West Coast and what's existing over there. Um. Yeah. I was, like, forced to think about time zones today against my will. Um, that wasn't great. We do need to discuss Christmas weekend. Um, I have the 24th and the 25th, and that's it. We'll go, we'll talk about it more, but, um, I work that Saturday, and I'm right back to it on Tuesday. Yes, yes. I don't normally work the 24th anyway. Sorry, I'm like, my calendar is like off in fucking la la land. It is a Sunday. Yes. And my goal is to keep my schedule the way it is, which is looking good. It's looking good to keep my schedule how it is. I hope that, um, I hope that it stays that way. But the odds are looking pretty solid. I've had some, some meetings with managers and such and like my, stats and quality assurance stuff so I can get the shift that I want is looking okay. So that's exciting. I'm not as stressed as I was last winter over my schedule stuff for work. So my mom's birthday is the 23rd. We'll talk but maybe go down that evening and definitely come home. Oh yeah. So would we we, we leave? No. How far? We'll talk about it more. But I feel like your parents' house is not, like, in the grand scheme of things, that far away. Um, yeah. Okay. So I, I haven't been, I haven't been to Pixie's parents' house. So in my heart, for some reason, it was like a four-hour drive. Um, but never mind. I take it all back. It's not as intense. But that's good. We'll talk about it. Message message me on Discord. Even if it's like right now. Um, so we don't forget. Also, you need to add me on Steam, Pixie. I would really love it if you could um click on that link too. I'll send you another one if I have to. But I would like to be friends on Steam. Your aunt is buying a house. Everyone's purchasing houses. <laughs> It's okay. It's okay. I just want you to see all of the cute games that I have on my wish list that you may like. Because I have like a hundred games on my wish list. And I'm sure you'll find something cute in there. Yes. I have lots of cute games on on my radar. Which I was thinking the other day, like I I watched the Game Awards, which it's been like a week since that happened. 
there's just so much content out in the universe. There's so many games to play. And like, I'm making a dent, like I'm working on it. But like, damn, I have so many games in my library <laughs> that I need to play. Frog Detective and Coffee Talk. You got it. I will, I will, um, highlight any that exist. Um, I'm looking at my normal library instead of my wish list. Right now it's sorted by discount, but there's just, there's not a whole lot that's discounted because the winter sale, when is the winter sale happening? Do we have that date? Steam winter sale, God? Steam winter sale, 2023. It starts in a week. It starts on the 21st. I'm excited. I am excited. Is there, oh, it's a specific website dedicated to steam sales honestly what a vibe um what a vibe what is this remote play together thing there's a remote play together event i love i love remote play together games Remote Play Together Fest celebrates playing your favorite games with your friends remotely. Oh my god. That's important. All the homies are like far away and I want to play games with the homies. Actually, now that I'm thinking about it, do I have tabletop sim it's on my wish list, okay. Because I really want to, like, make all my friends get Tabletop Simulator. That way we could... Because there's so many things. You can play Villainous. You can play Catan. You can play anything on there. You can fucking play Uno if you really, really wanted to. <laughs> I have it, like, my brother and I share a Steam library. So I have it through him, technically. But whenever... Um... Like, if he's playing games in his own library, I can't sneak in there and play games in his library, which normally isn't a big deal. Like, it doesn't matter, but Tabletop Simulator, like, I would, I'm, I would play that significantly and would, like, ruin his ability to play his own games in his Steam library. Um... I'm a board game bitch, dude. I love, um, I love board games. Like, my TV stand is, like, all board games. Um, if I had a bookshelf, like, I would, I would, like, put them. I don't have a bookshelf, though, so they go on the TV stand. Yeah, I family share with a few people, but I have the most games, so I'm usually the one hogging my own library. That's fair. It's just me and my brother. Um... So that, it's like kind of interesting though, because if we give each other games on Steam for Christmas, it's like you're also gifting yourself that game. So it's like, I, I don't know. Um, I just work here. I am just a goofy goober. Um, playing games, but I, I really do like board games. I want to play more board games. It's just, it's the existing is pretty terrible. And there's, I know, I know you always want to play board games. Mostly Krita. Don't look at, is he, is he, is he, he's with his parents. I may or may not have gotten a game for Krita for Mary Crisis. That's it. That's the whole tweet. 
all of my Christmas gifts are completed except for my father because I don't know what to get my dad. Um, because he won't make an Amazon wish list. But like Pixie and Krita and my family are done except for my dad. I even got a gift for Marcus, my cousin. And I just, I have something for your dad. It might be a credit card. Yeah, he texted me about it. And I was like, I will acquire that someday. No, he is aware of it. So it's fine. Um, and he texted me about it. So he, he's on it. He's prepared and ready. Um, yeah, he's on board. My dad is like the most prepared man I know for like so many things. Oh, I was like, what is this? I thought it was a box in the background. It was not. Um, yeah, that's the vibes. Oh, League of Legends vibes. I have been playing that a lot. And honestly, my, like, entire brain is going to be sucked into it because I want to, like, deal with the battle pass and get my goods. It's so terrible. It's literally the worst. Um, I'm going to be playing so much League of Legends in the next, like, two weeks. I'm, who knows how many more games I'll play, like, normal, whatever, till the end of the year. Because I'm just, I just have so, I have to get, I, there's this one thing that I really want that I missed when it first came out. And they brought it back. And I want to get this skin. And I'm just, I'm going to spiral into insanity. Honestly, I considered just playing League for stream today, but I was like, no, you need to take a break. You need to play a game. You need to do something that is not that. And then later today, <laughs> maybe after stream, after I take a break, we will um, play some more. But that's, that's where my head is at. And we'll see. Um, this is a Krita recommendation, so we'll have to, we'll have to get him the VOD. Um, I don't know if it's, like, moderately scary, because it's, there was a whole, here, I can, I can switch to full screen. In the options, um, let me also, here you have audio, welcome. There's reduced frights. I don't, I don't know. Also, where the fuck am I? Hello? Okay, there I am. There I am. Um, reduced frights. I don't fully know what that means. Um, I play things at the recommendation of others and we hope for the best. Um, it says that they recommend that you use a controller so that's what we will be doing. I need, I desperately need to get a new controller. I don't think they're supposed to be able to like rotate like this. I can spin that one around, but I can't move this one like that. This one is, is free scooting around though. Um, I've had this controller since I was in high school, like a freshman in high school. I just smacked the shit out of you guys. I'm so sorry. Um, I don't know where my little guy should go, my little, my little camera, but we'll see. It's going to be great. Um, oh, see, Taddy, we're on the same page, man. I mean, I've literally, this is like a dinosaur. I've had this for a lifetime, it feels like. It works okay. It's drifting a little bit. <laughs> it's not amazing. Wake up. Oh my god. It's not amazing. It's like, it does the job. Look around. Oh. Oh. I feel like, I know it says this is best 
best played with a controller, huh? Um, we need the... Okay. Roast marshmallow? Absolutely. Oh, fuck. Um. Oh, I didn't mean to just throw it. Oh, fuck. Okay. Extend stick. Eat. Yes. I have not played this before. Can we get, like, a nice mediocre toast? Not on fire. That's okay. Do your- do your work stuff. Um... I just work here. I don't really want to doze off. Can I talk to you? There's our pilot back from your pre-launch camp out under the stars, I see. So it's launch day, huh? Seems like only yesterday you joined the space program and suddenly here you are, leaving on your first solo voyage. What do you say? Ready to get this beauty off the ground? It's all fueled up and ready to go. Um, are you kidding? Of course I'm ready. It's finally time to t Damn. Hang on. How do you eat your roasted marshmallows IRL? Catch on fire, eat the blackened part, refire the gooey inside. I haven't roasted a marshmallow in a minute. Wait, hang on. The audio went crazy. It seemed so fine and so normal, and then, like, the guitars came in, and I was like, hang on a second. This is... This needs to be fixed. Okay. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I haven't roasted a marshmallow in a really long time. I just like a nice, even, golden, consistent, not catch on fire. Um... We're testing stuff. Speaking pilots, make sure you don't cross the ship the first time you put it down. Anyway, you need to get the launch codes from Hornfells. It feels like you're still loud as shit. But I think it might be okay. Where you can lift off, just bring us here once you said your goodbyes or whatever. Okay. Um, I mean, I really am like a, an up here golden, golden brown kind of gal. I can't really, like, tell. Like, I don't want it to be on fire, on fire. But I want it to be warm. It's like, it's like a little, it, this is, this is, this is what we're looking for. Eat. Well, I walk so fast. I'm literally the fastest little guy. Um, okay, I just work here. Hello, Krita's parents, maybe. Um, I, I, I listen to the recommendations, okay? Krita says play game. I say, okay. I, ooh, that was a weird jump mechanic. Krita says play game. I say, okay. You got it, boss. You put this in my inventory. I'll play it. Hello, it is me. Slate said you're blasting off in your ship today. I'm really excited to see the launch. Aren't you going to go into space? Aren't you? You better not change your mind. I'm still going. I'm going to space. It's been forever since anyone launched into space, and I really, really want to see it. Really bad. Hey, do you want to try out my model ship? Slate says it's just like the real thing, only less likely to start a fire. Are you not wearing shoes are you do you have cardboard for shoes fly model ship oh fuck okay wait up down i have to do up i have different thrusts no wonder why they said the controller is good for this okay up okay all right all right Okay, okay, okay. Is there a way to recover this? Yes. Ooh, no. 
Okay. Oh, shit. This is gonna be so terrible. Oh. Crushed it. Nailed it. Okay. Now we go for the other one. We're practicing. We're practicing. Oh. Can I come back up, please, God? Yes! Oh, fuck. Um... Um, can I land this on here? Hi, Krita. You haven't missed anything besides me roasting marshmallows and it, and attempting to land this. Um, I'm not understanding the depth perception now, actually. Can I guide this back to me? Oh, God. Is it coming back to me? I'm- oh god. Oh god. Slow down. Slow down! Slow down! Slow down! Okay. Okay. We're coming- we're coming back. We are... Coming back. We went on an adventure, and I'm... Still not... 100% aware. Am I going away? Hang on. Hang on. All right. We're coming back. Easy. Easy. Easy on the, the forward thrust. Um. Um. Ah! Well, you know what? I brought it back to me. Oh, no, I know. It was for funsies, though. You know? It was, it was, we go on an adventure for the, oh, oh. Mm. Mm. See, it gets a little bit harder when you can't see it. It's, 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 it's a little bit difficult when you can't see it, but that went okay. I feel like that went all right for for me flying for the first time. Damn, they... Oh, hello. I, like, crashed into you. Hello, hatchling. I hear you're leaving us to seek adventure amongst the stars. When you return, let's you, me, and Gossin open up a bottle of the good stuff. I'm only seeking adventure amongst one star, actually. The other stars are too far away. The good stuff is less delicious. Less... Delicious sap wine and more daunting digestive challenge. Another metaphor ruined in the name of scientific accuracy. Um, I also hope I enjoy my travels. There's, there's, there's stuff. There's people. Hello. Um. Hello there, space cadet. I hear you're leaving the crater today. If you meet any of the other travelers up there, remind them to take proper care of their instruments. Take care of yourself. I will do my best. Hello. Marl. So it's launch day. How's gonna miss you? Speaking of launch day, I was thinking about it. And the platform those ships launch from is getting old. Think, Isn't it about time you built a new, less flammable one? That tr big tree in the village would be the perfect choice. I wouldn't mind helping out the space program. Just say the word. Um. What? No, I just think it's in the way and someone ought to chop it down. You know, specifically me. You think this has to do with the time I fell out of it and broke my arm? That was when we were hatchlings. Who would hold a grudge for that long? Um, I didn't... Oh, God. You're actually blasting off. I'm told my odds of survival are statistically quite high. Yeah, the space program certainly come a long way. I should probably thank you for causing fewer flash fires than your predecessors. By the way, good luck with those retro rockets. Um, I... What is... What is time? Um, let me go back just a hair, 
Yeah, I gotta get the lore, and I didn't talk to anyone in our first area that I'm sure I'll have to come back to anyways. Um, I didn't go this way, but oh, this is requires launch codes. Okay, so we're fine. Nothing to see here. We already talked to that guy, and then we learned how to jump. I just, I had to make sure that we didn't miss anything. Ugh. Okay. Um. It just looks, it looks constantly different. Um. Okay, wait. This projector is linked to our sky shutter satellite, which is currently orbiting Timber Hearth. The satellite is equipped with two onboard cameras. See if you can take a snapshot of our village. Um, I mean, ooh, that looks kind of cool over there. That's a thing. Um, what a, what a time. This pilot seat used by a pioneering astronaut Feldspar in all that remains are of an arguable flight into space. Although it's been argued that such a distinction requires a breathtakingly liberal definition of flight, that day will nevertheless be, like, always be remembered as a landmark achievement on Herthian history. We have a, we have like a museum situation going on here. Y'all, they like, they like space. Okay. The, the sun orbits rather quickly. Um, okay. I think we've spoken to everyone. To the observatory. Or, I guess, spoken to everyone on that section. Hello, astronaut. If it isn't my favorite troublemaker. We wanted to play hide-and-seek, but Morianne won't let us borrow their signal scope because it's really delicate and not supposed to be thrown around like that. Hey, hey, can you use your signal scope? Can we? Can we please? We'll even <laughs> let you be it. Sure, let's play. Here are the rules. Galena and me will hide with these radios, and you'll use your signal scope to find us. Last one to be found wins, okay? Oh. We're, we're just going for it. Outer Miles Ventures, Hide and Seek. Interesting. Um... Hello. How do I even get over there? Can I? Oh, there's space. Excuse me. Excuse me, you hid really poorly. Ah! I hope that this is a waterproof device. God damn it. Okay. Take. Take two. Damn, I fell quite a ways away. Okay. Alright. We gotta... It's also not helpful that I cannot really see. Alright. Found me, but my hiding's always super good. Don't forget, you have to find both of us. I, I know, but I gotta get out from the thing. Okay, so... hiding somewhere crazy i won i'm happy thanks for playing with us you got it boss okay glad that you are thrilled there's a, okay hello fishing person Fishing rhyme, fishing rhyme, singing helps me pass the time. You're leaving the crater? Guess we'll all be a little busier without you around to lend a hand. That big water planet, Giant's Deep, that's where I'd go. Why? <laughs> Hello, Krita's dad. 
Thank you for retrieving me from the airport. I'm gonna crash this ship, probably. One time, after the rest of the village had left to sleep and it was just the two of us sitting around the campfire, Gabro told me about their first trip to Giant's Deep. They landed their ship easily enough in the waves, but couldn't see too far down on account of how murky the water was, I guess, too dark. Gabro wants to see what lay beneath the surface, so they decided to travel deeper. They traveled down and down, but suddenly Gabro couldn't go any further. I underestimated how boring this would be. Goodbye. I will. I was just pausing dramatically. As though exercising a will of its own, the water was refusing to let Gabbro go any deeper. It held Gabbro back, almost as if it were trying to protect them from something. And then, in the terrible darkness, Gabbro saw it. The tentacle of a hideous beast. Heard it from Gabbro himself. Gabbro can be a little fancyful, sure, but they aren't allowed here. <laughs> I mean, probably. Um, I guess we would have to go to that, to that deep water planet ourselves. Is the story true? Lovely question. Ooh, a flashlight. We love a flashlight. I'm just pushing buttons. Okay. Um. I saw smoke coming from Young Bark Crater up north and figured I should go check it out. You can use the scout launcher. Just please don't break it while I'm gone. Can use the scout launcher. No, my ruins. Quantum Grove Crater. Geyser Mountains. Young Bark Crater. What am I looking at? Aim launcher. Um, okay. Oh, fuck. What is happening there? What is going on? Interesting. What is over here? There's so much stuff. Oh no, we saw that. I think. Before. Okay. Neat. Okay. I mean, I guess... Does it just, like, do you fall into the earth at some- oh, okay. It does fall into the earth at some point. There's not a whole lot going on over there. Oh, but that's what? Okay. Alright, well, I hope you're, uh, safe over there by that little fire, buddy. Because I don't know what the fuck is going on. Hi, astronaut. You know the patch of ghost matter inside this fence? Gaussian said it used to be bigger when they were a hatchling. Because ghost matter evaporates. It just takes a super long time to go away. I hope there's still ghost matter in the village when I'm a grown up. Ghost matter is awesome. Um, you shouldn't be throwing rocks in there. Ghost matter is dangerous. Uh, obviously, that's what makes it so awesome. Jeez, I'm not dumb enough to touch it. You're such a grown-up. I... I had to touch it and see what was going on. What do you mean? What do you mean? You can de detect it with... Whoops. <laughs> it's uniquely painful and will probably kill you. Don't complain to me if you hurt yourself fooling around. Okay, well, wait. Use camera. It just is always... But, like... How would that... How does...
Ooh, I hate how it like burns into your eyeballs. Okay. I'm not like loving it. But that's how you get up there, probably. Because it doesn't look like there's any other way to get up there. And I want to see what's up there. They put a little step for me in... Oh. They put a little step for me in everything. You know? Oh, God. I... Why did it happen so fast that time? You are dead. Fuck yeah. Oh, that's it. Pack it up. The credits are rolling. Everybody go home. Um, t another game checked off of the list. Um, that definitely, like, was a great one. That amazing game. I'm so happy to be looking at the credits right now. Um, so I was thinking maybe we could play, um, I don't know. The only game that's coming to my brain is Bioshock right now. We should play Bioshock next. We should play, um, Transistor. Dream Daddy. True. True. Um, oh wow, we get, we just get sent all the way back to the beginning? What do you mean? What do you mean I have to go through the whole thing again? No. Am I supposed to have played, Taddy, am I supposed to have played that first? I just, I just, Krita makes a recommendation and I play it. Was I supposed to, was I supposed to have played that first? Daddy. Daddy. Tat-thulu. I. I'm gonna wake up now. First, I don't know. Okay. Well, that's, that's good. I. I just work here. We have all the knowledge, though. Whoa. Oh, let's get the two names mixed up. Okay. That's okay. I just wanted to be on the same page. And I was high-key. A little bit stressed. Wow. Now I'm, like, nervous about dying. Or falling. Or existing in any way shape or form is there a sprint button is this how as fast as i go flashlight oh okay i feel significantly less stressed this is not that okay but i want to come up here it it just looks like i should be able to go up there right I don't know. I I want to be on this part of the rock. I fucked up. I fucked up. Don't kill me! No! Oh my god. It. I should be able to make it up there. I I should be. It. I and I would have made it if I held the button down long enough. We're not looking at the credits. Speed run. Any percent. Let me in. Let me in. Let me in. Yep. Yep. And it, yeah. Maybe I should practice on these steps. Jump. Jump. Just don't touch, don't hit your ankles on the, the edge as you come up there. 
and it'll be okay. Ooh. Practice. Parkour. If I can make that jump, I should be able to make the other. If I can do that, I should be able to hit the other one. Are you fucking kidding me? We're getting this out of the way now. I'm not gonna be as courageous when I leave this, like, planet. And I'm farther away. Um, I'm fucking making it across this. I just, I just keep going. Okay, let me up. Okay. All right. Now, was it worth it? There's something here that's unknown. Interesting. I don't really know what that means. Yet. I don't know what that means yet. Let me up here. I made it to the thing. Let me have my prize. Let me have my prize of jumping on this thing. Do you mean to tell me that I did all of this for no reason at all? Okay, I could get in a bucket for a second. What the fuck is happening? Can I fall to my death? Oh. Um, okay, I, I would say that it is now worth it, but is there fall damage? shit man what am i supposed to do with that <laughs> um we i i i i was i had to i had to know what the vibes are i need to know what the boundaries are for the gameplay i how was i supposed to know if there's fall damage if I don't just, like, fling myself off the edge or something. I also didn't think I was going to be shot out of that. Like a cannon. So, like, there's that. I don't know. I didn't know what those physics are. Whoops, I ran into a tree. Um. Let me in. Am I... We... Okay. Well, I will I will do my best to live from here on out, but how am I sp I needed to know that if there was fall damage. I I had to double check and make sure. Uh, that is very clear water. You just look right through it. Um they told me that I need to get launch codes from somewhere. I'm not sure where, but that's my goal, is to acquire launch codes. Hmm. Oh, hello, astronaut. This is good weather for your launch, right? That's lucky. What are you up to? I'm using my signal scope to pick up sounds from distant planets. It's set to the Outer Wilds Ventures frequency so I can pick up the Traveler's music. Last night, I heard Rebex Bandro coming from Brittle Hollow. I hope that means they're safe. I can hear different planets, too. It depends on what time of day or night it is, since different planets are in the sky at different times. Signal scopes are cool. Oh, God. There's a man very quietly whistling off of the distance. It's very quiet for me as well, though. All right, let's go talk to this guy. 
see what's going on. I have to read this note. Hey, come say hi to your old flight coach before you launch. I've got zero G training set up if you want a refresh. I would love a refresh. Hey, I thought I might see you before the big launch. Nerves getting the better of you. Right, like you weren't nervous for your first flight? Hey, don't worry about it. Your nerves are between you, me, and the vast endlessness of space. But really, you'll do fine out there. I'll, I'd worry more about the ship if I were you. Hopefully that lunatic slate at least fixed the retro rockets. So listen, there's a satellite, which is definitely not just a piece of broken mining equipment, set up down in the zero-g cave in need of repairs. If you're looking for a little last minute zero-g practice, head down the lift and into the cave. Or don't, as long as you're confident you can make ship repairs in space. Um, alright. I will do my best. Um, down we go. Um, wow. This is a very deep cave. Okay, we press onward. Suit up. Okay. Hey, nice of you to drop down. I'm getting some zero, zero G time. You're going in there in the cave? What, no, I'm fine. Great, great, and fine. You don't look fine. Well, you know I hate that cave, so I don't know why you're making me talk about it. Ugh, got hand sweats. What are you talking about? You got hand sweats. Why are you nervous? I am now flying. Is there... Um... Have a limit on fuel. Oh god. The down thrust? Handy. Um am I going all the way down? That just seems scary and unnecessary, but uh Um oh fuck. Okay, wait, hang on a second. I gotta um okay i'm just bouncing around in the universe i would like to go up and it's just uh, um okay easy easy I don't know what we're talking about when we say uh what what am I repairing? I'm just flying around. Um whoa. Whoa. Should I go to the red thing? That's it. No. I, I, I now understand what I'm looking at. Where's my flashlight? Okay. N uh, no, I need to go. Okay. We're learning. Space. I guess there is very little. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. There isn't really a whole lot of sound. Um, besides the sound of me spinning through space. Do I have an, a different goal? What else is broken? Is it on this side? Whoa! 
I'm constantly going too fast. Okay. Let's, let's calm down here. I'm, I've never been so focused in my life. Can I get close enough to this? Okay. Oh my god, the wires are like fusing together again. All right. And I didn't use all of my fuel and my O2 levels are alive. Get me the frick out of here. Well, I'm bouncing. I'm bou I'm bouncing. Wait. Wait. Okay. 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 Let's Oh. Uh, well, they're good. Fuck. Hang on. Let me not be in here. Whoa! Hey! <laughs> okay, I can walk now. Hang on. Let me scoot my head over here. We don't care about... We don't... Whoops. We don't care about controls. Okay. Um, where's that guy? Can I get some more tea, please? Give me the dirt. Some fresh dirt? Not much happening down here lately. Come to think of it, Tektite saw something crash outside the village. Okay. Well, we knew that. In the cave. you know ricochet off the walls spin around a lot oh, okay i understand he just simply he does not like does not like it okay so that is did we come out of here what's where was What was up here? Oh, it's, I see. It's just a bit, it's all connected. So never mind. Look at my little blue hands. Now it makes sense why this was so fucking far down okay we're learning how to do stuff just remember your training and try not to hit anything big i can see you're itching to get off this rock so go get the launch codes from the observatory and get out of here best of luck and avoid getting yourself killed now that i put so much time into training you got it yeah um the observatory Excuse me. I like keep looking around like I'm gonna be able to get like collectibles or something. So far, there have not been any. Who is that? Why is there a whole last marble statue of this guy? Hello? Hey, hey, it's my favorite astronaut launch day at last, huh, buddy? It's translator's tools. Translator Tools Inaugural Flight 2. I'm so excited, it's making me nauseous. Just think, you'll be able to translate any of my text you want, anywhere you are. The two of us put a lot of hours into venting that tool, so don't break it, okay? Oh, jeez, don't break it. Ignore me, okay? I'm just nervous. I'm not even the one going into space. How are you feeling? I'm super excited. Good, you've only been waiting for this day since we were hatchlings. I can't wait to see all your training pay off. So what's the dirt? You here to see the new Nomai statue? Um, of course. Knew you'd want to see it before you headed off. Hornfell's just finished prepping it for a display today. Amazing, isn't it? Makes me wish we could see what a real life Nomai looks like. But I guess this is as close as we'll ever get. Check it out. Looks like they eat, had fur. Fur is weird. This is the first fully intact statue ever found, you know. And for how old it is, it's in great shape. Got a little carried away there. You have a ship to launch. Um. They do have it. It's got fur. Uh, an ancient species who dwelled in our solar system thousands of years ago. The statue provides us with our most detailed look at 
yet at the Namai who appear to have been covered with a layer of fur. Note the decorative jewelry that has been carved as a part of the antlers. Although their artifacts and structures have been found on almost every planet in the solar system, we still have no idea where the species came from or what happened to them. Interesting. Space! Space! Stars, like our sun, generate light and heat by fusing hydrogen into helium. As it grows older, the star runs out of hydrogen and starts to contract. Yep. As the star's core contracts, it gets hotter, causing the outer layers to expand. The star has become a red giant. When the core is hot enough, it starts to fuse helium into carbon. If a star is massive enough, it will continue to fuse carbon into e even heavier elements like iron. Ultimately, the star will collapse under its own gravity and then explode in a violent event called a supernova. Based on Chert's observations, this will one day be the fate of our own sun. Um... Uh, this crystal was taken from the Nomai ruin on Brittle Hollow. It seems to create a local gravity distortion and was most likely used to traverse steep surfaces. We love trying things out. And then... We are nearly ready. Felix and I have finished construction, and she says calibrating the device won't take long. Fortunately, the Adel or Rock's lack of atmosphere will make collaboration simple. After all this time, I'm thrilled to finally resume our search. Um... Um, interesting. Glad that we learned how to use that. And then there's a ramp. We're not going through everything in here. But we'll see what may be helpful. Whoops. At first, I thought the points of light in this image were stars, but they're not. They're galaxies. And this image just covers a tiny patch of the whole sky. Which means the universe contains at least a thousand times more galaxies than we previously imagined. I think I need to sit down. Yeah, we're getting, we're getting like, some more. Ah, oh, hello. There you are. I just finished pre-fight ori oh, orientations. Observations. And local conditions are good. Time to get our newest astronaut off the ground. And you'll be our first astronaut ever equipped with a Nomai truck. I <laughs> <laughs> the way that they told us about this translator tool quite a bit i yeah i'm so happy that you were giddy and excited about it though we're better equipped than ever to unravel the mysteries of the nomai you and hal should be very proud of your work tell me what is your plan i think i'll start with something small you'd prefer to ease into things that's a sensible plan more sensible than most of our astronauts tend to be and that's a fact do you think you'll go to Adelrock then? Our moon would be a safe place to travel and get your bearings in space, and I'm sure Esker would appreciate the visit. Plus, we don't know what the ancient Nomai ruins on the moon are or why they were built. You can put your new translator tool through its paces. Well then, it looks like that's all that's left. All that's left to send you off. All in all, fine day for a launch. Let's go. I've got the launch codes. Okay. Well, our goal should be <laughs> the way that it just zoomed out. <laughs> it's like, it's, is it going to be like baby Starfield? Ooh, I, I rotated this in a way that I didn't like. Um, yeah, we're starting small, but this is giant steep. It's got trash in its orbit. Ash twin and ember twin. I feel like I die trying to get there. 
Um, where is... I need the UR here. Oh. Okay. What's... What is it? That looks sick! What do you mean? It's like, it's a planet, but... The roots? That looks crazy. The interloper! It looks quite fast in comparison to everything else. Um, we don't even know what's going on here. There's something going on there. Um... It's going to be great. What is this? What is... What are you? I guess I'll never know. Alright. Let's go to space. 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 Oh, what's in here, though? What is this? The strange rock moving around in this grotto appears to react to conscious observation. The level-headed among us realize there must be some sort of optical illusion at play, but Gabro claims the rock exists in all possible states until it is observed, whatever that means. Whatever is actually happening, both sides of this debate agree the effect is extremely creepy. Hated that. Can I touch it and live? Okay. Didn't love it. Hello, buddy. Ooh, you're alive in there? The anglerfish spe specimen was found attached to the landing gear of one of our ships that flew close to Dark Bramble. It appears well-suited to living in dark spaces with minimal atmosphere. Um... The Nomai Skeleton. We can tell their skulls that they possess antlers and quite unusually only three eyes. Living on land, fragile bone structure. We could not have descended from their ancestors. Okay. Where the frick is the exit? Where did I come in from again? What was that? What was that? Was that like a a save point situation or Hey, so did you get a good look at the Nomai statue? Um, the statue was doing what? So its eyes opened, and you saw images from your own memories and glowing lights flying around. You mean like a hallucination? Listen, no offense, but you are you sure you're okay to launch? I will post the VOD. Please enjoy dinner. The statue is weird. If you're saying it happened, then I guess maybe it did, but why? Hornfells tried everything to get the statue's eyes to open, and nothing like this ever happened to them. I don't think you're going to get any answers from the museum statue, but Gabro said they were going back to Giant Steep. To know which island they're on, though. Maybe they'd be able to tell you more. On the other hand, Gabro's, you know, Gabro, so you better be off searching more info on your own. Okay. Um...
What? I'm, are you going into space and never coming back? Um, yeah, Hornfell says Feldspar went into space and didn't come back. Hornfell says Feldspar was the best pilot ever, but no one knows what happened to him. It's not something I want to think about right now. But if Feldspar disappeared, you might disappear too, right? You're not as good as him, so you should really be careful to not get lost. Gee, thanks. All right. Time for the launch codes, I guess. Um. Ooh. I mean, I feel like I should suit up for this adventure, no? What are we working with? Ship's log. Number Twin Ashtrin, Timber Hearth, Adderlock, Rumor Mode. I see. Um. There is so much information. We're not going to worry about that right now. Buckle up. Lift off and landing camera. Is there something else that I should be doing? Health and fuel full. I don't know. I feel like I, I'm going to wear the whole suit. Uh, let's not launch with that right over us. View map. Okay. Start small. Oh, fuck. I can immediately just look. Oh, shit. Okay, hang on. Hang on. Oh, but we don't want to match the velocity into into the thing! We don't want to match the velocity in... to the thing. Okay. Am I gonna... I'm, am I gonna engage autopilot? Okay, Jesus Christ. Uh, stage three, autopilot complete. Landing mode. Oh my God. Is this what I want? Is this, slowly. Slowly. It's spinning quite fast, don't you think? It's... Easy. E easy. I don't know if I want to land there either. Am I gonna roll? Okay, let's... Okay, that feels better. That feels good. Open hatch. Flashlight. We made it in one piece, okay? We we did that. Um signal scope. Oh, hey, it's you. Ground Control didn't tell me you were launching. Long time no see. Actually, I guess it's been a long time since I've seen anyone. 
Don't other travelers come by? The Lunar Outpost saw more traffic back when our ships were less sophisticated and needed more frequent repairs. Nowadays, it's mostly used to keep a set of eyes on things. Sometimes Church comes by to say hi. The Gabbro is Gabbro, and you know how Ryback feels about unnecessary space flight. Don't go. I mean, is there anything else you wanted to ask? Was that you whistling? Probably. Actually, definitely. The other travelers carry instruments, so they don't bother whistling. You can pick up their music with the signoscope. Best spot for that is the North Pole. Great reception. The North Pole is marked in red on your mini-map, but the Adel Rock is a pretty small moon, really, so just go north. You can't miss it. Seems pretty lonely. I'm in touch with ground control. Hornfells and Gassan mostly, and they radio ch up to chat now and then. And when ground control forgets I'm up here, and they usually do, I launch my little scout at the village. They forget about you? I don't blame them. For one, I don't check in as often as the other travelers since I'm always in one place. And it's not so bad up here, really. At least it's peaceful and quiet. You don't always get that in our solar system, let alone in our village. What is this place? Very funny. Oh, stars above. You're serious, aren't you? That's just depressing. Welcome to the Lunar Outpost, which apparently the space program doesn't bother to teach anyone anymore. When we first started Outer Wilds, travelers used to bring their ships up here all the time for repairs. Our spacefaring technology has improved loads since then, but the older ships tended to fall apart a lot, like more than they do now. Using the outpost cut down on the number of launches and landings taking place in the village and also the number of fires. Nowadays, though, it's mostly just me up here raising saplings from Timber Hearth and keeping an eye on things. Talk to you later. Okay. I guess I didn't need a whole suit. Oh. Okay. Time skipping is a thing. Um, we're going to the North Pole. Oh my god, I'm stuck. Still not picking up Rybeck's banjo from Brittle Hollow. I'm sure they're fine, but I'll feel better once I can hear their music. Listen to Chirp play for a while today. Unrelated, someone should tell Porphy and Gassan their flirting is not subtle from an aerial perspective. Banjo music coming in loud and clear. Today I heard something strange. It's back again. Something strange is coming from Timber Hearth. Okay, know that this is crazy. The sound from Timber Hearth sounds exactly like Feldspar's harmonica. The Feldspar's disappeared in space ages ago. It can't be them. It's still here. It's creepy. Maybe my signal scope is broken? Interesting. Oh god, the sun. Um. Listening to these is kind of crazy. And very interesting. Where is it coming from? Up of this planet. What a time. Okay. Um... And then I have like a little 
Oh, I don't like not being able to see. Oh, wait. I No, it's too late. It's like my O2. But we're going. Does it, like, refill on contact? It does. So how does fuel... How is refuel jetpack? But how does... How do... Do I just always have stuff? I may just always have stuff. I don't really know. Okay. So, we've started small. That's not the map button. We started small... I guess we can just go to the next, like, place. We don't need to go, like, across the universe. That's where the banjos are. Um, I can't see. Am I just trusting that? Oh. Okay, autopilot complete. Um, equip scout launcher. I'm trying to just orbit this, orbiting this, and can we like chill for a second? Can we chill for a second? Can we chill for a second? Okay. Who needs... Who needs landing mode? I guess we're just gonna... Oh, God. Um... I'm moderately heavier. I'm What the fuck is happening? Huh? Can I go back to this, please? Can I go back here, please? I'm incredibly confused. What do you mean I am here? What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean I'm here? Where the? No, I don't want to lock onto that. I'm. What do you mean? I'm getting close to it. I'm... I feel like I can't tell. I'm getting closer to it? It says I'm getting closer to it, but it doesn't feel like I'm getting closer to it. Why is the ship... Why is the ship... I'm literally so confused. Am I going to die in space? Why do I... F Why? Um... Oh. 
Why did it say negative 26 kilometers? I'm just gonna die floating around in space! Not the... Am I... Wait... Why is the ship here? That's not... I'm... So incredibly confused. Did I... Uh, did I... How badly... I'm still floating. I'm still floating away. Didn't I... Didn't I... Am I insane? Because this is the planet that I fucking landed on. That has the banjo. No. Where is it? That is where I was going. I've literally never been... Why is it so far away? I'm just gonna float around in space until I die? Why does it... Did the ship fall? What am I supposed to do? Three minutes of oxygen remaining... What am I supposed to do? I'm just hurtling around in space. And for what? For why? Um, um, uh, am I not allowed to lock on the ship that is somehow staying? I got it. Oh, I'm flying into the sun. Oh, I'm flying into the sun. Um, I'm flying into the sun, I guess. Did I just die? Whoa, bad dream or something? You still look half asleep, but that's a negative on being deceased. I know it's tradition to sleep out under the stars the night before launch, but if you ask me, it makes you all a bit jumpy. Um... Um, I feel like I don't know what to do with this information. I died, but I've remembered everything. So... Um, am I allowed to ask you questions? Okay. 
Well, we have the launch codes, so we're just going to go back into space. Jump. I think. Um. I can free look. Was that an option before? Where the frick is that other planet? Hollow is where I would like to go. Right? No. No, it is not. Hang on. All of the names of these planets are fucking... No, it is. That's where I want to go. I'm not crazy. I have it marked. It's gonna be fine. We're gonna go to this planet. Oh, was it? Oh, is this this? I am understanding what's happening. I was. It's the speed I'm accelerating towards this planet. Um. I would love to engage autopilot, actually. Hello? Hello? What do you mean? What do you mean? How... How does autopilot work? How does autopilot work? It, autopilot... Autopiloted me into the side of the place. What do you mean? Y'all good? Are we good here? Banjo Man. Is probably directly on the opposite side of this planet. But we're gonna find him! And it's gonna be okay. Uh, oh, I was like, why are the lights off? Okay, we're gonna figure this fucking thing out. Okay, we're gonna find out where this man is. I guess we can just go in landing mode, but oh, but I don't have, no, not landing mode. Not landing mode! Not landing mode! Oh my God. He like okay this feels more promising okay landing mode downward thrust let's calm down 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 okay no 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 Am I insane? Hello? <laughs> what do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? Okay, that's not gonna hit my guy. Okay. 
Where the fuck? Hello? Didn't I, like, land right next to this pit? Okay. Okay. No. How the fuck does anyone get- Oh, here we go. Okay. 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 <gasps> A thing! Okay. Easy. Easy. I broke my legs. A little bit. Um, but we we made it a place. Activate the gravity cannon. Call the shuttle home. Things are blowing up. What are you talking about? How am I making this light up? Oh. Oh. Oh, wait. Oh my god. How am I supposed to do this with broken legs? Okay, is there more to read? Hang on. Hang on. The shuttle is currently resting at the quantum moon. Is that... What is the quantum moon? I feel like I've... I've never been more confused in my whole entire life. You know, I'm just happy that there's something here. The crossroads west? Crossroads. I wish there was a sprint button. I guess my legs are broken. What was I holding? Oh, the scout. <gasps> A building. What the fuck is going on in this- ah! Um, okay, hang on. the crossroads still. Okay, what's happening here? With the gravity, can I get in this? Oh shit, oh my god. Trees detected. The way that I feel like I'm gonna be playing this game for quite a long time. Okay. Bones. Stuff. Wait, he's not that far. I don't think. I don't think he's that far. Hang on a second. What are we doing? Was I supposed to stand in this? Is this what this place used to look like? No. No, it, no, it, that's, nope. What the fuck is going on? Okay, what's, am I gonna get put in soup here? Or? Am I supposed to stand up here still? No. Um, I'm gonna, Oh, wait, no, it's just... I'm at the shuttle. I'm ready to make my first pilgrimage... Oh, God. To the quantum moon. I'm literally working on it. 
That's exciting. You're almost ready, but there's still one more rule you need to learn. Come see me at the Tower of Quantum Knowledge. The tower is on the opposite side of Brittle Hollow. If you follow the path west to the crossroads, you can reach the tower from there. What do you mean too close to the target? My gratitude for the directions, Bells. I'll see you soon. Ship log updated. Okay. I'm gonna pick this up. I'm gonna take me and my broken legs. Some somewhere. I'm just so I'm um Is this supposed to be familiar? It's giving lecture hall. I guess I can move around just a little. Oh, but there's... Okay, so I think I'm gonna need to keep that, no? I keep fucking doing that. Um, I'm j I guess I'm just gonna hold on to this. I'm gonna hold this. And I'm gonna attempt... To... Um... All right, I didn't break my legs. Southern obs okay. Um I would like to try and do whatever was going on with the gravity thing. Like what was going on here? And was there a spot to put something? Okay. You're gonna just go there. Whoa! Don't pick up your thing. Uh, okay! We did! We did something! We were successful in an adventure of some kind. Okay. Okay. So let's let's go in that thing, I guess. Um, I'm taking this little tablet with me everywhere I go though. Um Okay. Hello. I'm getting so trees detected. Um, oh, it turned me sideways. I am here. After watching it wander through the skies for so long, I'm about to stand for the first time on the quantum moon. As expected, my shuttle has landed at the moon's south pole. I will make the remainder of my journey on foot. We don't know why the quantum moon always welcomes its visitors at the south pole, just that this is true. As a child, I considered such unknown sinister. Now, though, I understand they bear no ill will. The universe is, and we are. I am ready. You are ready? For what? Oh. Um. Do I... What did I just do? Where are we? Every second that passed... I'm getting farther and farther away from my ship. Uh. What the fuck? Okay, so what about... Why can't I go to that one? I'm 
What am I doing out here? Do I want to just... Do I want to do this? Do I want to hurl into space? Can I... Well, that's not helpful, but it is bright, so that's handy. <gasps> what is that? Fucking get off of my screen. What is that? What am I... What am I doing? How far have we gotten from... How far? Okay. Like, what is... There's nothing. It's, like, almost... Sickening. Let's... Let's pick this up. And try and get to this man. I've never wanted to meet a banjo playing man so intensely in my whole life. In my whole life. Okay, so is there a path further down? I, it looks like it spirals a little bit. Oh. What happened? What was that? Did a piece just get eaten? What if my ship is the piece that gets eaten? Um, is there, like, a way down there, or? Can I just go? Okay. I overshot it. I overshot it. I'm getting sucked into the void. No! Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, but I still have my little thing. Whoa. Wait, what is this? Hang on, I can approach this. This is approachable. This is something I can do. No, I'm gonna overshoot it. I'm gonna overshoot it. I'm gonna fuck. Shit, fuck. Shit. Fuck. Hang on. Okay. Now we go towards it. I'm learning. Oh, okay. 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 I'm on it. I'm on it. I'm dropping this on the ground. Whoa! No! Lock on. Go into the thing. Let me in. Okay. Oh god, I'm gonna throw up. Oh my god, I'm gonna throw up. 
What do you mean trees detected? What do you mean? I'm in a- oh. Shit, okay. Whoa. Okay. Ember Twin Projection Stone? Oh, wait. Welcome to the White Hole Station. If you fell through the black hole by accident, don't worry, you aren't the first. This warp tower can return you to Brittle Hollow. Every warp tower is tuned to a specific astral body. A tower's warp can only be used during the brief window when the tower is aligned with its corresponding astral body, in this case, Brittle Hollow. You must be standing on the warp platform on the floor during this alignment to be warped. If you look up while the station is rotating, you can see the alignment happens when the astral body is directly overhead. Okay. Um, what am I supposed to do with this? Am I supposed to keep this? Ember Twin Projection Stone. Whoa. Am I... Am I supposed to go this way? Am I bad? Oh. What is happening? What are you doing? Do I want you in there? I have never been so lost, but that's okay. What the fuck is happening? Oh, okay. Oh, I died. Sick. Cool, 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 cool. Or I'm getting warped? I think I died. I'm not sure how I feel about this yet. Um, I don't know how I feel about this yet. I'm just confused, but at least we'll be back at a familiar place. I don't know. S space. The final frontier. You're lucky I'm in a time loop, because otherwise I'd be super dead. And you're lucky I don't have you grounded for medical reasons, because I have no idea what you're talking about. I want to go look at the statue. I want to go look at the statue. Um... In the museum situation. And I want to go to that water planet and talk to the fishing guy again. Oh my god, the waterfall is literally so loud. I don't know why it has to be like that. Okay. Um... this way okay okay i gotta get my bearings um i have so many questions i have so many questions hey look at this the statue opened its eyes bet you wish you'd seen that happen huh me too not even a little closer understanding what's going on with this statue. Was there something you needed? Where are the other travelers? Well, let's see. Chert is on the hourglass, hourglass Twins, Rybeck is on Brittle Hollow, and Gabro's on Giant's Deep. And there's Feldspar, obviously, but of course we don't know where they are or if they're even still alive. Feldspar has been lost for a very long time, I'm afraid. Tell me more about Feldspar was one of the four founding members of Outer Wilds, along with our flight coach, Gossen, Slate, the engineer, and me. As ground control and later the museum curator, I didn't work with Feldspar as closely as Slate and Gossen did. I can tell you Feldspar was absolutely fearless, though. Nothing scared them. 
Test piloted everything Slate ever built. It's wonderful feldspar lived to see space, frankly, but they did. Flew all sorts of dangerous stunts and explored everything they could find. And then one day they just didn't come back. We don't know what happened or where Feldspar went or even whether they're still alive. It's been a long time since they left. Um, they used to be closed. Probably should have started with that. And now they're open. We're not sure why they opened since no one actually saw it happen. But this is huge news. Um, okay. Um, photos and stuff. I'm... I have many questions. But that guy is downstairs now. And not up here. I don't know if that is, like, particularly important. Or if I can be nosy. No, we already read those. I don't know the... I mean, I'm glad that we learned about the teleporter thing. Watch closely. These balls move on their own. The ground is perfectly level, so what do you think causes a spooky motion? The answer is the moon. As it orbits our planet, the outer rock's gravity pulls on objects from different directions. In fact, it's pulling on you right now. Gravity. Okay. Aside from dwellings and structures they built, Nomai also made art. This decorated pottery was discovered on Brittle Hollow. Some ancient Nomai art depicts strange animals, foreign celestial objects, and other subjects that can't be found in our solar system, which makes us wonder whether the Nomai art originated elsewhere in the universe or simply had vibrant imaginations. Were the Nomai born in our solar system, or were they born among other stars and planets? And if they were, how and why did they come here? These are just some of the questions we hope to answer through Furrow. Xeno archaeological expeditions. I don't know how to read. Um. Gosh, I just feel like I have so much thinking to do. But it's like, inst um, um. I don't know. If I die here, not that I like want to die here, but you know, existing. Um, Oh, I didn't. Okay. Um. Tell me about the traveler's instruments. Church drums, Rybeck's banjo, Gabbro's flute, a harmonica. Anyway, if you hear music in space, it'll be one of the space program's other travelers. If you feel like company, you can always pull out your signal scope and track them down. I would love to do that. The banjo is slowly killing me, actually. Um, I never individually spoke to you before. Oh, that's bad. It wouldn't have mattered anyways. Okay. I feel like... My brain is not operating at full capacity for this. God, the, the water is so loud. Every single time. Um, this is interesting. Very interesting. Because... Let's try to fly to the little moon again. Do like something moderately safe. 
starting small. Um... Don't. Okay. Okay, let's calm down for a second. Jeez Louise. Okay. Is this... What is happening here? Is this... Oh god. Unbuckle. So, Pre-fight! What? What was that? What was that? Jetpack auto duty, yeah. What? Jackpot boost can be triggered with a separate button press. Yep. Reuses time while reading translated text. Oh. There are certain periods of time where time cannot be frozen. Reese is time while using the ship log. Reese time while talking. So prevent character. Ah. Uh... That's an interesting pre fight checklist. I wasn't I didn't even know existed. Um what is happening here? I'm Didn't I land on this before? Oh, it's coming with me. I don't want it to do anything. Nope. Oh. What is happening? What is happening? What is, uh, okay. Um, I was upstairs testing the eye signal locator and it can hear the following signals from the sun, giant's deep, and brittle hollow. However, something strange is happening when I ask the eye locator, eye signal locator to follow the eye signal. The device's indicator rotates wildly and never points to just one direction. I see. It, I most likely collaborated the locator incorrectly. Privet, my apprentice, and I will try to make adjustments and try again. This is a curious result. It is possible the eye has stopped calling out its signal. An update. Disappointingly, everything is still correctly cal calibrated. It saddens me to post at this, my friends, but I believe this locator cannot detect the eye signal. We would need to build a more sensitive device if we wanted to locate the eye of the universe. Then we will build it. Don't lose hope, Kasava. Our search for the eye is what brought our clan to this place. We won't give up so easily. Okay, ship log updated. Um, trees detected. It, every time it does that, it's a little bit scary. Okay. I mean, 
guess. It's fine. Hello, I would like to talk to you, please. Hey, it's you. Um, Marl says hi. I should go see the big lug soon. Don't tell him about this, but sometimes I throw my little scout down to make sure Marl isn't doing anything stupid. I'm worried that big tree in the village wouldn't stand a chance otherwise. Whatever, it just seems only... Okay, yeah, this is all the... All the stuff. I feel like I don't even know what to do with myself. And I can't go into your house and snoop. Because that's rude, apparently. Oh, let me turn on the flashlight. The ship. The ship. Okay, I'm getting a little bit better at controlling myself, so that's good. Um. Alright, we've, we've done a, quite a few things. Were they substantial things? I don't know. But we've been a handful of places now. Um, oh no, it's... Okay. Um... You, oh, view rumor. Okay. Wait, what does this mean? What is... What is the exclamation mark and the star? Um, okay. I'm not gonna lie, my brain is super fried. Not that I didn't enjoy this, but I feel like I didn't come into this with the, like, right train of thought. Because there's so much stuff. Also, no, the music volume is fine. Sound effects, I just don't know what it is. I, I my brain is like mush. It's this is like I'm I've never played like a space game before, so it's super neat. But the like, remember when we thought that it was unforgiving with um death. And how um, I died, like, four times before I even went off planet. Like, there's just so much to do. There are so many things. And... We're gonna have to, like, explore recklessly tomorrow. And just, like, go everywhere and anywhere. Because this map, whoops. Let me look at the map. Um. Oh. Oh, it has, okay. Okay. And then it's rumor, okay. What is this? Whitehall Station. There's more to explore here. Okay. Okay. I like that they're, that they're telling me that. I appreciate that greatly. Okay. Well, I'm, I'm glad that I figured that. I knew that, at least. Okay. 
we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. I'm now that I like kind of know what the what the vibes are and like what kind of information I need to absorb. I feel so much better about this, but I need to use my brain and think about things tomorrow because I'm 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 fried. <laughs> so that's the plan. That's the goal. I suppose we'll be playing the Outer Wilds for a little bit then. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But we will um, pick this up next time and maybe hopefully play a little bit longer now that I like know what's happening. Um, and we'll see. We'll see what's going on. <laughs> It's a much different adventure than I was anticipating. But be good eggs. Don't do anything too silly. And I'm gonna do some research. Minimal research. About the main planet. Um, make good choices. Be good eggs. <laughs> I'll see you next time.